How you doing, sis? Hi, how are you? Okay, God bless you. Um, tell me about this new book release that you got. Yes, yeah, so the name of my book is My Current Past. It's about a story of pain to purpose, right? Because in life we are dealt, you know, several things that we have no control over, but we have absolute control over how we handle those things, right? We have the power of choice that God has given us. And so we can decide to use our pain to be a crutch, or we can decide to use our pain to discover our purpose and who we are, what we mean in life, and how we can uh, be effective to others. So the story is about a search for a mother's love. Um, growing up, my mom was an addict. Um, she was on drugs. And um, it was very hard for me to figure out just what was I here on earth to do um, if my mother wasn't around the person who everyone says, oh, you know, your mom loves you so much. Your mom's always going to be there. You hear so much about mom. So to not have one uh, left me pretty lost. And so all of my life I tried to figure out, you know, why I didn't have a mother, why my mother had to be an addict. So I searched for things like academics, I searched for people around me to give me that love and support that I was missing from my mom. And so, you know, I turned my pain into purpose. Uh, I wrote my very first book as a self-published author. Um, I'm super excited, it's doing well on Amazon. It was Amazon's number one new release. And um, I also have a companion journal to go with it because this is how I coped uh, while my mom was on drugs, uh, I would journal a lot. And so my journaling ended up, um, you know, I, I transitioned that into my very first book. So I am a super supportive of the power of journaling. Um, I understand what it can do for a person to process what you're going through, to figure out why you're going through those things, and then to discover your purpose. So the journal is a companion um, to the book. Awesome. Okay, um, tell me how this... Um, book came about. What what was the what was your motive to write this book? Yes. So uh, when I was writing it, the goal was to reach out to people that may have experienced some things similar to what I did as a child. Um, not having a parent involved or having a guardian that is addicted to drugs or alcohol. Um, you know, not having that presence. What can you do for yourself? Uh, what things can you get into? What things should you invest in? And to find self-worth for themselves, to feel like they deserve these things. Um, and so I wrote the book hoping that if I could reach just one person that may be experiencing doubt, you know, low self-esteem, um, worry, depression, any of those things to come out of that by writing and expressing yourself so that you can then discover who you are and what you are meant to be. Awesome. Okay, so how can the people all around the world be able to get this awesome book you got so it's on amazon you just type in my current past my name is jerry davis jones but again if you just type in the title my current past you will find it on amazon um, both the journal and the book is on amazon you can also check out my website which is author jerry.com that's author j-h-i-r-e-e.com okay awesome These your t-shirts? Yes. So the t-shirts are actually quotes from the book. Uh -huh. um, the title of the book is From Pain to Purpose. Mm -hmm. um, so discovering again how to transform that pain into your absolute purpose and direction in life. And then the other is persevere until your vision is clear. Um, that one is super powerful because you know sometimes we forget why we're working at things. Why are we going to school? Why are we at this, you know, this job or career? Um, what is that reason? And so sometimes we just keep digging even though it's cloudy and then one day, you know, ultimately God will provide you with that reason, that vision. And so in the meantime, keep going towards those dreams, keep fighting, keep pushing towards those goals so that in the end you can understand exactly why you're doing it. Awesome, awesome. Nice book cover. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. Thank you. Okay.